I just got this USB device to give me extra storage on my iPhone. The first time you plug it in, it's going to ask you to install the software. Just click on the App Store right here and it takes you directly to the App Store and to the application. Just simply click on the Get button in the top right hand corner. You don't see it here because I've already installed it on my iPhone. I'm now installing it on my iPod Touch. It takes about 30 seconds to download. Pretty nifty device. Hey, over there is my cat, Fei Fei. Fei Fei's sitting in a place we call Cat Corner. When she's in Cat Corner, it means she wants me to come and play with her. Fei Fei, you're just going to have to wait. I'm shooting a video. Uh, so now I'm going to open up the app. And it will show you how much space you have on your iPhone on the left. On the right, just click that round thing. It shows you what's inside. Now I did mention it's a USB storage device. Pull it down that way, you can see the USB slot. And I use that to plug it into my iMac. And up here is the lightning connector. Now I installed a PDF and a movie for this demonstration purpose. And it's a 64 gigabyte. Did I mention it's very nifty? Hey, Fei Fei! you got to wait. Right, back to this. I'm going to open up the PDF. I'm now going to scroll through that PDF. And there you go. Now, I'm cutting these incoming messages. And that's why I missed there's a done button in the top left. I'm quitting the app, which is silly. Now I have to relaunch the app. If only I had noticed there's a done button. So, back to the storage. This time I'm going to check out the video. Go away. Open up the video. And it's Fei Fei! Woohoo! Fei Fei in action! Fei Fei is uh, 10 months old. And she's so cute. So this time I am going to click on the done button in the top left hand corner because I had noticed it was there. And down here in the bottom left is a plus sign which is very cool. It lets you do all these things. I'm going to take a video. The first time you use it of course it's going to ask you permission to use the camera and the microphone. And now I am shooting a video which is not going on the iPhone. It is going directly to that USB storage device. Fei Fei? 